hypokalemia associated with hypertension now the causes are just remember this mnemonic 11 let, little cons from this 11 we say 11 beta hydroxylase deficiency now from little we just remember little syndrome from cons we remember uh, cons syndrome which is also called primary hyperaldosteronism and from this cons we also remember the Cushing syndrome so these are the causes of hypokalemia with hypertension uh, that we are having these cons 11 little cons so 11 beta hydroxylase deficiency little syndrome Cushing syndrome and Cohn syndrome which is also called primary hyperaldosteronism all these cause hypokalemia associated with hypertension the cortisols and aldosterone uh, will increase the absorption of sodium in the collecting ducts and also increase the secretions of potassium and also the secretion of proton or hydrogen so increase absorption of sodium there will be hypertension increase the secretion so the uh, potassium will be less that will lead to hypokalemia increase the secretion of proton so that the proton the potassium they will come out in the urine there will be metabolic alkalosis now 11 beta hydroxylase deficiency this enzyme actually convert this cortisol into cortisone so if there is deficiency of 11 beta hydroxylase then the cortisol will be uh, there will be more cortisol and in the Cushing syndrome there is also increase in cortisol level and cortisol is having mineralocorticoids activity which means there will be increased sodium there will be hypertension decrease potassium hypokalemia and decrease proton that will be metabolic alkalosis here you can see this diagram. The Cohn syndrome is primary hyperaldosteronism, which means there will be hyperaldosterone. Aldosterone level will increase and will also affect on this channel. Increase the absorption of sodium, so it will lead to hypertension. Increase the secretion of potassium hypokalemia. Increase the secretion of proton, that will lead to metabolic alkalosis. The Liddell syndrome, which means that they will, the gain of sodium channel, like this sodium channel, is getting more it, it is going to be more activated so mm, more absorption of sodium and secretion of potassium and secretion of hydrogen or proton liquorice which can also defect 11 beta hydroxylase enzyme so they can also cause uh, to increase the cortisol and in, increase the sodium absorption secre increase the secretion of potassium and secretion of proton so liquorice is also one of the cause of uh, hypokalemia associated with hypertension Carbo carbonexolone which is anti uh, ulcer drugs it also cause hypokalemia associated with hypertension now you guys can see this mcqs which one of the following is recognized cause of hypokalemia associated with hypertension you can just remember the mnemonic 11 little uh, cons see here we can see the little syndrome is the cause of hypokalemia associated with hypertension so the right answer is a